tough enough. That's the message from a judge who believes a plea deal for a former West Palm Beach doctor guilty of manslaughter is too lenient. John Christensen pled guilty to two manslaughter charges related to overprescribing pain medications. News Channel 5's Charlie Keegan breaks down what happened in court. And, um, as I said, former Dr. John Christensen was supposed to be sentenced to one year in prison Wednesday. We made a deal. The former West Palm Beach doctor pled guilty to two manslaughter charges and an oxycodone trafficking offense in state court. He also had a federal fraud case. The deal was he'd get the same sentence in state court as in federal court. Last month, the federal judge sentenced him to one year in prison. At this point, state Judge Dina Kiever did not think one year was appropriate in a manslaughter case, so she threw out the deal. I feel a deal is a deal, but we'll, uh, of course, honor what what she told us to do and we'll decide how to proceed. Now Christensen has three options. Agree to a deal with up to five years in prison, negotiate a new deal, or go to trial where a conviction carries a 25-year minimum sentence. My son was 24 years old getting 500 pills a month. Authorities did not charge Christensen in the deaths of Ken Fusco and George Lazarek's children. Hopefully um, justice will be done. But both men are pleased the judge ruled against a short sentence for Christensen. The only way I'd be comfortable truly if he died in jail. But five years is better than one. Christensen will remain in house arrest until at least his next court date, January 25th. In West Palm Beach, Charlie Keegan, WPTV News Channel 5.